there, buddy. How you doing today? Hope you're having a nice Memorial weekend. It's a beautiful day here in Arizona. Um, I have my daughter with me today. Her name is Sheila, and she wants to make a picture for her bathroom. So she's picking the colors pink tourmaline. I'm not exactly sure how to pronounce that. <laughs> it's a craft uh, Michael's Smart Craft Smart and then we also have Plum Michael's and then we're going to use black and we're going to use metallic silver hopefully we'll have enough of this because we kind of ran short of it but she's just going to try to design it the way that she wants and go ahead and start well we are using a 12 by 16 was it? I think so I yeah, I think it was a 12-6. We did tighten our canvas, and we're all set to go on that. We're using the two parts flow trawl, one part paint, one part water, no silicone. And we need at least, we've got about two 8 by 10 so we need at least 7 ounces, but we're going to go 8, you know. I think there's a lot quite more a bit than, there, yeah. <laughs> than what we need. I don't... I've never done this before, so I'm just giving it a try. Um, I want it to primarily be black because my bathroom is black, silver, and pink. So I'm going to try to do it with a lot of black in one cup and then more of the colors in the middle. Again, I really have no idea but just like honestly I really want a lot of black on the outside and this might not turn out at all so you can do a dirty part pretty much a controlled dirty part I thought you were going to use two cups. I am. Okay. This is going to be more the outside. It looks pretty together. So what do I do? Swirl it now? Like that? Just like an S. And show it to the camera. The color. Okay. And then do your other one. Wait, you get your other cup going first. Okay. I don't want it sitting this too long. One, I don't want that much black in there. Okay. So then let me put a little. Yeah, we did see a couple chunks going in there when we were mixing the paint, so we might be pulling out a couple chunks of flow troll. Good old flow trawl. Everybody runs into it. A lot of people strain their flow trawl in a strainer. You know? That's all the silver, Mom. Yeah, well, it'll, you know, it'll work out the way it works out. So we said there wasn't a whole lot of silver left, so. I think you got plenty paint there. I think so too, oh my goodness. Okay, just do it good. Just need to do a tiny little. But it's always better safe than sorry. And then sometimes you don't want too much because then you gotta, of course, tilt off all your cells if you did get cells, you know? All right. I'm like so afraid that this is gonna turn out horribly wrong. But I have an Still. idea in my mind okay. of what I want. Yeah, try to get them to kind of touch, too, a little bit. And then, you know, there you go. Remember, you can get different colors here and there. And the next one, stay in the middle so you can get those. That's Look what at I the want. cells. I wanted this more for the See? outside. If you use too much, we're going to be pouring off a lot of those cells, so. Oh, that's a lot of silver. 
You said we didn't have enough silver. Use it on the outside until the other colors come out. Because that's a lot of paint. It'll blend. I know, but I'm afraid I might not have enough black in there now. Now it's going to have a big line right through it that's like that. Okay. All right. I think that's enough paint. Now you know what to do from here, right? Um, I think you use the torch. Right. Oh, I forgot about the torch. I wasn't about ready to torch. Not all the way. It won't light real low. Like okay. that? Yeah. Or lower? A little bit. That's good. As long as you're like five inches away. And don't stay in one spot. You know how to do it. Right, good. Doing just popping bubbles there. Not too close. Is that what you're the, too close again? It pops dots. bubbles and it does draw up some cells. It's pretty. It, I don't see a lot, a of, lot black. of black, but that that you'd be surprised how that stuff surfaces out. I really wanted a lot of black. I always pour over stuff too. Too close. I don't. Just... Here, mommy, you do it. Okay, we're good to go. Okay, so should I stand up for this? Yeah. Okay. Start on one end and try not to let it flow off and maneuver it so that it's. And a corner and start. I know, I just don't want it to. You're losing a lot there, okay. But you're tilting too much. Okay, there you go. It sure is beautiful. You have to I shake don't really it like that. see black. You don't It'll pop out. That's not going it's off the corner though. there, Mommy. It will, we'll get it at the end. I would have stayed going that direction, but that's okay, because all your paint was over there. Yeah, I don't see a lot of black. I really wanted... More black, huh? More black. Okay. So just finish pouring that, and we can pour a couple more drizzles of black on there. We'll give that a try. Yeah, I would like that. Okay, so stop. Okay. All this right. way or this it way. is pretty though. It it does look pretty. That's I, hope, fine. I hope cells pop up. That's not enough black. No, I, I really wanted a lot of black. It and is, I'm telling you, cells may not pop up because of the metallic. You've got two metallics in here. That pink was metallic, and the silver was metallic. I told you, but we had some to begin with. In the gray. But that's just the way they do. Okay. I want black. All right. What kind of a design would you want a black? So just put some light strips, okay. not puddles. Like a good little swirl here, maybe swirls here, and a few swirls. Okay? Okay. That's how you want it? I think so. I know this is like totally not you, but I think this is what I want. Yeah, and you That actually looks kind of cool what it's doing. Yeah, just give it some time. You know We're what? We're going to tilt it out. Mom? You're going to put some more over there? I'm liking what is happening here. Okay. Honestly. All right. Then you do what you want to do when you like it. No, That's cool. No. All right, so now it's let's... Like This might be a total <laughs> no, mess. No, it's what people do. You know, that's how you can find out what you like, what you don't like. So I like how you see here how it's kind of like yeah, like you can just tilt in. it a little bit, just okay. kind of working around a little because you didn't pour a lot on there to where you have to pour it off. Just work it around so that it'll kind of look natural instead of 
put on. It's kind of neat now, huh? You're right. Are you liking it? I really actually like it. I, I wish those lines were a little more bold, but I like it. You can do it real quick, but don't get too, too much. I don't really see much cells in this. No, it's that darn metallic stuff. Something about that metal in there, or whatever metallic is made out of. It just... I warned you ahead of time about that, didn't I? Yeah, you did. But you know what? I do see some cells popping up here. And they will. A few will. Um, It seems like they pop up more when... It's not so thick. It does. So what you want to do is where end don't you like? This bottom. All right. So then let's get some of that off so you can see some cells pop up maybe. Looking good there in the middle. That's what I'm liking. See? It's just a matter of experimentation. <gasps> I'm really liking it now. Good. But see now where the cells are? I see over here I'm probably going to lose... I'd be surprised they'll still pop up. I'm liking it too. Keep going with that down in there. Because you got lots of black up at the top. Yeah, it's stretched that way over there. It'll pop up some cells, maybe. We like it. I'd bring this down just a little bit more here. And then I would call it quits unless you want to stop. What do you think? I want to stop because stop. Because, okay. I'm sorry. Just because I want to hand paint a black bird on that. Okay. So that's good. So we're going to torch it, but we're going to be very careful because we don't want to put white specks. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but it's shimmery. It's metallic. Do you see that shimmer? Yeah, that's metallic. I don't see any cells. No. Darn metallic does Yeah, I mean, that. it might eventually. Nah. Every time I've used metallic, that stuff just doesn't my, want to do my that. My corners right here aren't completely covered. We're going to work on that in a minute. That's okay. not necessary. You're going to take the drippings from the bottom of your painting. But I dig this, too. So let's go ahead and do a close-up shot real quick before also, the light pops off. If it's okay, I want to do an 8x10 to go on the other side with the leftover paint that we have. Is that okay? It's pretty. Yeah. Do you have any more 8x10 cameras? No, but I have one painting that I don't want. You can paint over it. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. I just hope it's focused right now so they can see the beauty in this. You did really good. And you know what? Like I've told you guys before, she was really good at decorating. So she just knew exactly what she wanted and what she was looking at. And... She could create some beautiful pictures. I am definitely planning in this area right here to hand paint a black silhouette of a bird like these tattoos. That's not in the camera. Put the tattoo. There you go. Oh, no, I just touched it. But, yeah, I want, like, I'll probably do these two very birds just right here because that's that's my bathroom. Let me get a little more clear focus shot here. Is it focused a minute? There. Now it's focused. So it's real pretty. Look at that marbly stuff. She did. And you know, like I've said before, if you don't like it, don't go pouring off everything real quick. Because you want you can always add more. I like that I added more black. Mm -hmm. But I think with the birds there, it'll it's just going to be pretty. Okay, and then what we're going to do is just kind of want to see this end real quick. I see cells it's coming same. in. Yeah, it's not going to sell up a lot. I do see some cells coming in, though. It's weird. After a time, it, like, starts to pop up. I've used metallic a lot of times. And I don't think I'm focused. Nice. It's not focusing. Nice. There. Okay. Hi, Emma. So it's pretty. 
guys. I think this is probably the prettiest one I've ever seen. And I've never made one this beautiful. But my fine. daughter knows what she's doing with colors. She can create things, baskets and colors. And well, I think that just matches my bathroom. And and it's really nice. So I love it. And we'll go ahead and we'll scrape the bottoms like this. And we'll just touch up those ends. Maybe we'll do a part two with the 8x10. Yeah. The same way. Okay. Thank you for watching, you guys. Bye. Check you out later. And thanks, Sheila, for sharing this video with everybody. That's awesome. And your picture is beautiful. Press like if you like it, guys. Let us know what you think. Bye-bye.